The following tutorial is brought to you by the University at Buffalo Libraries Access Services. This tutorial contains both video and audio. This tutorial demonstrates how to use the CINAHL database to locate scholarly journal articles. Produced by the University at Buffalo Libraries Access Services. The Cumulative Index to Nursing and Allied Health Literature, or CINAHL, is the primary database used for nursing research. To access the CINAHL database, go to the University at Buffalo Libraries homepage at http library.buffalo.edu. Hover over Libraries and Collections, and select Health Sciences Library. On the HSL homepage, select Databases above the main search area. A drop-down menu appears. Click on this menu to see a list of the main databases UB offers in the biomedical sciences, and select CINAHL. One of the best ways to search CINAHL is to use subject heading mapping. Along the top ribbon, click CINAHL headings. We see a simple search bar with three options underneath. The default, relevancy ranked, term contains, and term begins with. We'll keep relevancy ranked selected since this will tell CINAHL to match the term we enter to the most relevant subject headings. Let's craft some example searches. We'll type telecommunications into the search field and click browse. CINAHL returns a list of subject headings that are relevant to our search term and we can see that telecommunications is a CINAHL heading. If we click the telecommunications link we can see the tree view of the heading which shows all of the related headings and subterms within the telecommunications category. This allows us to look at other terms we might be interested in, or to narrow our search even further. On the right side, there are options for shaping our search. Explode lets us include every subheading within a heading category, and Major Concept makes sure that the articles returned will focus on our topic rather than only giving it a passing mention. We can also search for specific scopes within a heading using the Qualifying Subheadings option. The more options we select here, the narrower our search will be. For this search, we are going to select Explode to ensure that all the telecommunications subterms are searched. Major Concept, so that we don't get results which don't focus on telecommunications. And Trends, for our scope. To perform the search, click Search Database. CINAHL has returned 882 results. This is too many to browse through, so we want to filter them so that they're more specific. On the right side is a column with options to limit these results. We'll click Search Options for a full display of ways that we can make these results even more relevant to our research. We know we need materials published in the last five years, so we'll enter 2005 to 2010 in the Publication Year fields. We only want to view journal articles, so we will select Journal Article from the Publication Type list. We want these articles to be in English and to be high-quality scholarly material, so we'll select English Language and Peer Reviewed. It might also be useful to limit our results to those found in nursing journals, so we'll go to Journal Subset and select Nursing from that list. Then we'll click Search to apply these filters. Now we have only 21 results to look through. CINAHL shows us that our search options are active with a red check and Options Set text. These options will remain in place for all future searches unless we reset them. Let's try another search, this time for medication errors. We'll click New Search from the top ribbon, and this time we'll select Suggest Subject Terms above the search fields and enter Medication Errors in the search field. CINAHL brings us to the same subject headings page as our original search. For this case, we can see that the Medication Error subject heading has no subterms, and therefore it cannot be exploded. So we'll just make it the major concept and begin our search. Because we added no other qualifier subheadings, we have almost 5,000 results. In Search Options, we'll filter for Publication Year, 2005 to 2010, Publication Type, Journal Article, English Language, Peer Reviewed, and Journal Subset Nursing. Even with all those filters, we still have 838 results. In this case, we need to go back to our search options and narrow even further. We'll change publication year from 2008 to now, 
so that we only see articles published in the last three years, and change the journal subset to core nursing. Another useful way to limit would be to select the research article option, which will focus the search to articles which cover quantifiable data-driven research. Everything else will leave the same. Now we have 168 search results, which is a manageable number. Thus ends part one of our tutorial about the CINAHL database. In this tutorial, you learned how to search using CINAHL subject headings and how to limit your search results. Please continue on to the tutorial Introduction to CINAHL, Part 2, Keyword Searches and Selecting Search Results, to learn how to perform keyword searches in CINAHL and how to find and organize search results.